All right, so I have some exciting news. I've made a um, photo grid generator that you can use on your reference photos when you're doing grid drawing. I know that there's some free ones out there, but I never could find one that did everything I wanted it to do, so I made my own. This is on my website, unschooled.art. It's a free tool. Free, feel free to use it whenever you want. But you're gonna come here, choose file, and I'm just gonna choose a screenshot from my iPad and you can see that it gridded it right away there's a grid on it right away and it's all equilateral squares that was very important to me that i had a grid drawing tool that did nothing but equilateral squares because i know a lot of the free ones they'll give you rectangles and different things and then you're trying to grid your paper in the same rectangles it's just very hard to do i'd rather do everything being even on all sides so that's why i made this so automatically, whenever you upload an image to this grid gener generator, it's going to attempt to give you a perfect grid first. And if you look down here at the bottom, it tells you automatic grid, perfect fit, 16 by nine. So if you have a 16 by nine kind of aspect ratio, it's probably gonna grid it out for you perfectly. But as we know, images are not always gonna be the perfect size. So if you have, one that's not perfect and let me find my download folder because i uh well actually let's just click this this is some keith herring skateboard art that i saw online all right so if you look down here at the bottom of the window it tells us perfect grid not possible mathematically it cannot figure out a way to give us equilateral squares and cover the entire canvas so over here it shows us that a grid requires cropping to maintain to maintain equal squares. So to do that, I'm gonna come over here to the canvas and I'm just gonna click and drag. And you can see I can drag that grid exactly where I need it to be. So even if I drag it right here to the tip of the skateboard, you can see at the bottom, we still got, you can see here, 39 pixels outside the grid that's gonna get cut off. So I'm gonna come back over here to the left column and I'm just gonna adjust this down to seven. And then I'm gonna to try to drag on the canvas again and see now everything is covered by the grid. So this is where it differs from the other free online grid um, generators. So this is a nice tool to have. You can also, um, if you needed to, increase the size of your lines. You can come over here on the left and also change the line color, which is nice. And if I can go back to that first image that I showed you, if you have something with color and you want to see more of uh, values, you can just click on the black and white mode. And now you can see the midtones and the highlights and things like that a little bit better. And you can even drag your slider to change the intensity of that. So that is my photo grid generator. I think that you will um, get a lot of use out of it. So feel free to use it. Feel free to share the link with other people. Um, and let me know if there's any other features you want me to add to it. I tested this with the Chrome browser. So if you use Safari or something else and you're having problems with it, please let me know. But it's there for you to use, absolutely free. And um, I hope you get a lot of use out of it. Share the link and let me know what you think.